Happy weekend once again, guys, and I appreciate you taking the time to tune in, leave comments, and of course, participate in our giveaways. And today's review is going to showcase three brand new designs from our friends at VL Watch Faces. And while the layout and the functionality of these are basically identical, the designs and the theme choices are very different, so you're going to be able to get some great customization options here. Plus, I'm also going to be randomly selecting 10 winners to receive a coupon code for one of these three faces, your choice, so make sure you leave a comment below. Okay, let's go check out these brand new faces from VL Watch Faces. Okay guys, kicking off the review is the VL Hybrid 2, and as I said at the start, these three faces are identical in their layout and functionality, but that certainly isn't a bad thing here because not only is the layout practical and attractive, but the functionality is extremely helpful given the amount of customizations you have in all three of these faces. So for example, tapping on the menu text along the bottom left of the bezel reveals both your theme customizations as well as your app shortcuts. From here you can change the colors as well as the styles of the backgrounds, the LCD screen, the frame along the bezel, plus you can even lighten or darken the LCD brightness which is a great way to tone it down or to make it easier to read, particularly if you're in low lighting environments. Now for features, you have the digital time above, and this can be set in either a 12 or 24 hour format. Then you have your battery status underneath that, which is shown as a percentage and with those glowing dots on the right hand side. Then there's a date dial on the left hand side, which shows the day, month, and date. And then on that LCD panel right at the bottom, you have your total steps count, your calories burnt, your floors climbed, as well as your last recorded heart rate, which is shown just next to that very unique heart design. Okay guys, carrying on, here is the pro version of this model, which still carries forward all those great features I mentioned in the Hybrid 2 version, plus you get a number of additional customizations, and the best way to see those are by tapping on the menu area once again. On this model, you have all the combinations of the previous one, plus you can change the colors of the hour and the minute hands, you can change the colors of the detailed text next to the LCD panels, as well as that hybrid label at the bottom of the face. Plus, you have even more color selection to choose from for your backgrounds, for your LCD panels, for those bezel frames, and for those backgrounds, by the way, include military-inspired designs in the form of different camouflage styles. So if you like the first design and you want to make it even sportier and more rugged looking, then this model is a great way to accomplish that while keeping the great functionality from the previous face. All right, and the last one in this series is called the Chernobyl Edition, and this one has some very relevant theme differences, with the most obvious one, of course, being that radiation button right in the center, and double tapping on that changes your backgrounds, which also comes loaded with some radiation patterns. Again, very fitting for the theme of this watch face. And tapping on the menu for this model, again, changes up the selections that are available, as well as providing some unique styling cues, including the date below which identifies the day of the Chernobyl disaster. And interestingly enough, the developer even told me that there will be an added easter egg around this date, so I'm very curious to see what he has in store for that. Now going back to the other extras you get, as I mentioned you get a variety of different backgrounds, but you also get some radiation themed bezel frames, plus some radiation stickers that pop up and move across the display depending on the position that you want them in. Again, these are small touches, but they're really nice ones because these styles all stick to the overall theme of the face and it gives you more flexibility on how you want to personalize it. And lastly, all three of these models have been optimized for the AOD mode.
And if you want more information on the watch face that I reviewed today, then simply do a search in the Galaxy App Store under the name of this face. The full details, including the direct link, is included right in the video description. And I'm also going to be giving away free coupons to random and lucky viewers that comment below. I'm going to leave a reply under the winner's comments to let them know exactly how they can get a coupon. As always, good luck to everyone, enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Thanks again for watching our review, and if you liked it, then show us some love with a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and share the video with your friends, because with your support, it really helps me keep the channel going, so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways, and of course, fresh content. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.